What's up guys, welcome back to another episode of Kerr Outdoors. Uh, I'm Stanley, I'm here with Jameson. Uh, we're the hosts for the show today, and uh, today we're actually gonna be out here at one of our local reservoirs, and we're doing a little bit of spear fishing. We've never had a chance to spear fish in Utah. Um, we've been a bunch off of the uh, coast in California, um, just by Catalina Island, if you know anything about that. Um, uh, but uh, it's super fun and we don't get to do it a lot so we've got all the equipment and uh, we're just running Hawaiian slings and snorkels and fins and super basic gear but just enough to get us by and uh, yeah so uh, 20 or 30 minute drive out there into the desert and uh, we'll just we figured we'd bring you along so uh, we'll show you when we get out there and we can shoot our uh, excuse me we can shoot carp trout uh large mouth uh supposedly there's smallmouth bass in the lake that we're going to oh smallmouth that's what it yeah, is yeah we've seen carp we've caught pretty big brown trout out of there and mm -hmm. there's decent sized rainbow trout so it should be good Ho the goal at least for me just to get a fish even like no, get sure. close hopefully we'll find some cool stuff on the bottom too that's yeah it's always fun hopefully no dead people <laughs> but okay. yeah it should be good <laughs> no yeah for sure yeah. It's a whole different game out here in Utah than it is in California, but yeah. luckily the laws are super simple, so uh, shouldn't be worried about uh, disobeying any laws, which is nice. And uh, yeah, goal is just bag a few fish and be home before dark. Like so have some fun. Good deal. Oh, okay, there you go. Sounds good. We were really excited to finally get the opportunity to be able to go spear fishing at this lake. It was something we had been wanting to do for a while, and we're stoked at the opportunity to finally do it. Um, we didn't really know what to expect when we got in the water. We didn't know what the visibility would be like or if there would be any structure or stuff like that. Getting in the water was definitely a little bit difficult with the rocks. Visibility where we were at was not ideal. Six, seven feet max. And we were still getting on fish. And how we were doing it was just diving down and they'd either be right there and we'd be right on top of them or they weren't. Um, we're by no means professional spear fishermen. We don't know a lot about it, but we were still getting it done by just diving down and having our pole spears ready as soon as we were there. You had to we, we found out you had to have it cocked, ready to go, because you're only gonna have like a five or 10 second shot opportunity before they're gone. And I actually managed to get one this awesome smallmouth bass, my first ever smallmouth bass, which I'm completely stoked about. Great fish, um, making awesome members, doing an awesome thing. Alrighty guys, well, uh, that ends out the video. We shot, Jameson shot the one bass, okay. and uh, and yeah, that's all she wrote. Pretty fun time though, just diving around. Yep. That lake is kind of gross, we have discovered. <laughs> Hopefully we don't and, get you uh, audio. We're gonna, we're gonna see. Yeah, yeah, that would be nice. <laughs> <laughs> Definitely drank too much of that water, but yeah. Uh, saw, yeah. Um, yeah, we saw a lot of bass. I definitely, I probably missed like three or four. There's a few good schools of them. Saw a crawdad. Yeah. Pretty sweet. Yeah, better than I expected. James actually got one, so. Yeah, I know, right? <laughs> there's a, just kind of a cool little spot. We'll be coming Very back awesome. most likely and uh, giving it another try. Maybe when we've got a little bit more time, we came a little late in the day. Yeah. Uh, we'll have to come in the middle of the day and hopefully the visibility will be a little better. Yeah, that visibility was a little crazy. Like it was probably at best, like, I don't know, like five feet, just uh, in all directions. <laughs> yeah. Like, and then if you get to the bottom, it was a little better. I don't know why you guys could see that in the video I got of my little knockoff GoPro, but it was, it's pretty fun. Nonetheless, yeah. it's pretty awesome. Good time, that's for sure. So my first smallmouth bass, did not think I was gonna get my first smallmouth bass spear fishing, but hey, that's, Won't I'll take whatever. Right? Yeah. <laughs> so. yeah, no, yeah, there you go. Okay, thanks for tuning in on this video. Um, we, uh, we're trying to make videos every week, and uh, we've, been, we've been doing okay at posting a video every week, so if you guys haven't already, make sure you subscribe. Uh, we're just kind of laid back, trying to do what we love, trying to bring you guys along. And uh, yeah, hope you get, hopefully you guys enjoy the content. Like I said, subscribe, give a thumbs up, and uh, we'll see you next week.